hello goddesses welcome to goddess playbook oh my goodness i am going to do a john fluvog shoe unboxing t uh, unboxing actually since it's fluvog it should be unboxing that's a new term john fluvog you're welcome to use that um just give me a free pair of shoes no i'm just kidding y'all i look John Fluvog makes amazing shoes. I have three pairs of Fluvogs. They have all been purchased secondhand. I have never had a brand new pair. This is my first brand new pair. So I'm going to unbox them and show you what they have done, what they have sent. So first of all, it came in a big blue box like this. But when I opened it, it had this like red string and it was so like really pretty. So I'm going to go ahead and take this away. And I'm going to show you exactly how it came, and you guys are going to love it. Let me see. I probably should have thought about this a little more. So here is the lid of the box. And I have to say, as far as shoe boxes go, y'all, this ain't no flimsy. Like, this is an actual, like, really sturdy shoe box. Like, I'm going to keep this because it is very sturdy. So all of this stuff is in here. So um, I'm going to turn. This actually has the name of the, hang on, let me... This, I'm going to cover this up. This has my name under my thumbs. And some of y'all know my name and some of you don't. But yeah, so happy, there's a handwritten notice, handwritten note from someone named Feather. This on the inside has all of their return policies and all that kind of stuff. They included a copy of my receipt. And I got these on extremely, extremely clearance. And I'm talking like more than half, um, way more than half actually. And then it also had this card telling me, you know, where some of their stores are located. And then it had like stickers and it had like, like, look, let me just take this. Y'all, this is so cool. I've never, I've never, I didn't know they did all this, but I'm not even surprised. Embrace peculiarity. Oh honey, I do. And then a Fluvog sticker. And then this one says, the next time someone asks you where you got your amazing shoes, instead of watching them stumble on the name, smile and hand them the answer. It's spelled Fluvog. And this is adorable. And then there is um, tag your Vogs. So it totally says show off your Vogs on Instagram. And it could end up on the product page. And insert the style name. And it's, yeah, Roz is the style name. And then... Take the road less traveled. It's just a little postcard, which I love. And then check this out. Y'all, these folks know how to do it up. This is actually a very, as you can see, you can't really, this is not a flimsy shoe bag. This is a great shoe bag. It came with a shoe horn. This is a button holding the shoe horn on that says resist boredom. And I love everything about what they do. So on to the shoes. Oh, yes. Why is this part of the Goddess Playbook? Well, let me tell you. Have you ever wanted to buy a pair of completely impractical shoes? Oh, well, that's exactly what I did. Y'all, that is some impractical shit right there. But they're hot pink, and they are fantastico. Check that out. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, check the heel out on this. Ooh. Yes, girl. And check out the little skulls all over the buckle. Y'all know that is witchy as hell. These are a size eight and a half. I have read online that some of his shoes, look at this. Ooh, I don't even know. Protect your soul. What does it say? Temptation? Temptations. Be vigilant. Protect your soul. I'll do my best. And then there's like a signature. Yeah, and the size. These were an eight and a half. I can wear an eight and a half or a nine. Um, I have a pair of his boots that are actually a nine. Um, so I think it really depends on the shoe family. But yeah. Y'all, I think these shoes are going to make me feel like a goddess. I mean, I already feel like a goddess. But you know, I'm probably going to put them on with some freaking jeans and a blazer and just rock the hell out of them. So I don't know. I just wanted to include the very gorgeous Roz. Woo! Yes, queen, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Pardon me while I worship at the altar of the amazing shoe. Yes!